To write the Lewis structure for BeI2, that's beryllium iodide, let's count the valence electrons up. Beryllium, that's in group 2, it has 2 valence electrons. And then iodine, that's in group 17, sometimes called 7A, it has 7 valence electrons. We have 2 of those, so we'll multiply that by 2. That gives us a total of 16 valence electrons for the BeI2 Lewis structure. We'll put Be in the center, it's the least electronegative. And then we'll put iodine on either side. Next, we'll place a pair of electrons between atoms to form the chemical bonds. And then we'll go around and complete the octets on the iodine atoms. At this point, we've used all 16 valence electrons. The iodine atoms, they have an octet, both of them. And then the beryllium in the center, it only has four valence electrons. Beryllium, that's an exception to the octet rule. It only needs four valence electrons. So this is the Lewis structure for BeI2. You might think of trying to put pairs of electrons here to form double bonds, in which case iodine would still have an octet, and then beryllium would also have an octet. If you check the formal charges, you'll see though that this is not the best or most likely Lewis structure for BeI2. The best or most likely structure looks like this. This is Dr. B with the Lewis structure for beryllium iodide. Thanks for watching.